Which you guys got another video on how to reset your keyboard when it's not working. So I've got a Corsair keyboard here. This is an RGB keyboard, and you can see I've got three white flashing lights on the very top here. Also, what's happening is the RGB is not working and it's not responding the way it should be. So white lights are flashing on your Corsair keyboard, then this video is for you. I'm going to show you how we can reset this and try to fix it and get it working again. And I'm going to show you how to do it in a couple of simple steps, really. And besides the RGB not working at all, when you start clicking on the keys, it starts doing multiple different strokes on the key when you push the keys. That's something that's been happening uh, to this keyboard. It just happened when I changed it over from one computer to another. So the first thing to do is to unplug your USB cables in the back of the computer, just like so. And this will turn the uh, keyboard off, as you can see here. So I've unplugged both of the USB cables. This one comes with two USB cables. And you can see now the lights have turned off. What's next step is to hold the escape key. So you need to press the escape key down while unplugged. And then we can then plug in the uh, two USB cables back into the computer. So I know it sounds weird, but just keep your finger on the escape key. I've got the camera in one hand and I'm plugging this in with the other. So I'm using someone to hold the escape key down. So basically hold the escape key down and plug back in the USB cables into the back of the computer. And uh, once this is done, uh, you should then see the lights go out on the actual keyboard itself. They're not uh, on, as you can see here. So after about five seconds, release the escape key. You would then see the keyboard lighting flash, and this means you've reset your keyboard. So I've got my fingers on here. I'm going to release the escape key now, pull out the USB cables one more time, and then plug them in because I didn't get the flash. So what I'm going to do is release the escape key, and basically what I'm going to do is plug them in one more time, and then basically we should see that RGB flash. Unfortunately, I think I missed the actual flash while I was recording the back of the USB ports here. But when you plug these in, you should hear the USB sound of being plugged in, and then you should see a flash on the keyboard, and it should then populate, and you should see something looking like this. So everything is working okay now by just resetting the keyboard. So before you throw out your Corsair keyboard, try this trick. It does work, and it works pretty well, and it resets your keyboard, and hopefully you'll have your keyboard back up and running again. You can see we have solid lights up the top there. This was the K70 version of the Corsair. I know it does it uh, on other Corsair keyboards, so try resetting the keyboard the way I showed you, and hopefully you'll have your keyboard back up and running. Anyway, I've been Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. I'll catch you in the very next video. Bye for now. Thank you.